हेलो माय व्यूअर्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट एन अनदर एग्जांपल ऑफ वेल्डर कनेक्शन सो लेट्स टेक एग्जांपल नंबर टू डिजाइन ए स्वीटेबल लॉन्गिशनल फिलेट वेल्ड टू कनेक्ट द प्लेट्स एस सोन बिलो to transmit a pull equal to full strength of small plate given plates are 12 mm thick grade of plates fe 410 and welding to be made in workshop here as shown in the figure two plates are to be connected by fillet weld one plate is 100 mm wide and the other plate is 160 mm wide and both plates has thickness 12 mm as given in the question so let's start the solution part first of all i have written the given data ultimate strength of plates fu as the grade of the plate is 410 so ultimate strength of the plate is 410 newton per mm square next partial safety factor for weld which is denoted by gamma m w it is taken from table number 5 of is 800 2007 as the welding is made at workshop so gamma mw for soft fabric fabrication is 1.25 that's why i have written 1.25 and also mention the reason since it is soft weld next yield strength of plates fy as the grade of the plate is fe 410 its corresponding yield strength is 250 newton per mm square next minimum size of weld see before i design the fillet weld i have to fix the size of the weld if you see the table number 21 of is 800 so from the table number 21 thickness of the thicker plate so our the thickness of the plates are 12 mm so in this table we have to consider serial number 2 as our plate is 12 mm so for 12 mm plate the minimum size of the weld is 5 mm so i have written as 5 mm here next maximum size of weld so in is code they have not given directly what should be the maximum size of the weld but in clause number 10.5.8.1 they have written that when a fillet weld is applied to the square edge of a part the specified size of weld should be generally be at least 1.5 mm less than the edge thickness in order to avoid washing down of the exposed edges figure 17a so that means the maximum size of the weld should be should be the thickness of the plate minus 1.5 means 1.5 mm less than the thickness of the plate so 12 minus 1.5 mm is the maximum size of the wheel so it is 10.5 mm therefore i have provided the size of the fillet wheel as as 10 mm in between 5 and 
नेक्स्ट डिजाइन स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द वर्ल्ड द डिजाइन स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द वर्ल्ड इज कैलकुलेटेड फॉलोइंग द क्लॉज टेन पॉइंट फाइव पॉइंट सेवन पॉइंट वन पॉइंट वन फ्रॉम आई एस एट हंड्रेड टू थाउजेंड सेवन एज आई ऑलरेडी टोल्ड इन माई लास्ट वीडियो दैट दो द फॉर्मूला इज फेलिट फॉर ओनली फिलेट वेल एज पर द गिवेन आई एस कोड बट दिस फॉर्मूला फॉर डिजाइन स्टैंड ऑफ द वेल्ड कैन बी यूज फॉर एनी टाइप्स ऑफ वेल्ड सो दिस फॉर्मूला एफ डब्ल्यू डी इक्वेल एफ डब्ल्यू एन बाय गामा एम डब्ल्यू इज यूज टू कैलकुलेट द डिजाइन स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द वेल्ड अगेन एफ डब्ल्यू एन इज रिप्लेस बाय एफ यू बाय रू थ्री तो दिस इज द फाइनल फॉर्मूला एंड इफ आई पुट द कॉरेस्पॉन्डिंग वेल्यूज ऑफ एफ यू एन एफ एम डब्ल्यू देन फाइनली आई गेट द वेल्यू ऑफ वन एट्टी नाइन पॉइंट थ्री सेवन न्यूटन पार एम एम स्क्वेर सो दिस इज द डिजाइन स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द फिलेट वेल्ड नेक्स्ट डिजाइन स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द प्लेट ड्यू टू यलिंग इज गिवेन बाय इफ आई फॉलो द क्लॉज नंबर सिक्स पॉइंट टू डिजाइन स्ट्रेंथ ड्यू टू यलिंग ऑफ ग्रॉस सेक्शन सो हियर आई हैव कैलकुलेटेड द डिजाइन स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द स्मॉलर प्लेट टी डी जी I have used this formula for T D G, which is equal to A G F Y by gamma m naught. Gamma m naught is taken from the table number five, and F Y is the yell strength. So the thickness of the thinner plate is. If you see the figure. The thickness of this plate, hundred into twelve. So here, A is equal to hundred into twelve. F Y is the yield strength, and finally, we have got the value two seventy two point seven two seven kilo newton. This is this is the strength of the plate due to yielding. let the effective length of the well be lw then effective through thickness t equal 0.7s so this is the effective through thickness we have considered 0.7s where s is the size of the well if i put the value of s As 10 mm, so through thickness T has comes out as 7 mm. Next, design strength of the joint, which is equal to A Z and F W D. What is A Z? A Z equal to L W into T. Length of the weld. Into effective throat thickness, and what is F W D? F W is the design strength of the weld. So here I have not put the values. Next, now equating the design strength of the joint with data plate. As in the question, it is mentioned that. We have to design a suitable longitudinal fillet wheel so that it can bear the pull equal to the full strength of small plate. So the strength of the joint should be equal to this. Is the strength of the joint is equal to the strength of the design strength of the plate. Okay, that's why I have equated design strength of the joint with the strength of the plate by putting the values of T and F W D. 
I shall get the values of LW which is 205.74 mm. So remember this is the total length of the wheel to be provided in the joint. So that means 200 suppose approximately 206 if I divided it by 2 it is 103 mm. So we have to provide at least 103 mm on both side. This is 103 mm and this is 103 mm. We have to provide at least 103 mm on both side as a longitudinal fillet wheel. But we have finally provided little more than the required one. Therefore, provided on sorry provided an effective length 105 mm on each side so we have provided little more than the required so this is the design of the longitudinal fillet wheel according to the given problem so finally this will be the drawing so instead of 153 you have to show this as 105 mm and remember after the completion of the design calculations in the exam you have to show one neat sketch so this drawing you have to draw after the whole design calculations and you have to show the length of the wheel which is calculated as 105 mm so this is the design of fillet wheel so if you have any queries so you can comment me at the comment section of the video or you can mail me through my in my personal mail ID. so thanks for watching the video if you have liked the video please share and also subscribe my channel thank you